With good news for today from Baptist Press, I'm Brandon Porter. Women in the slum brothels of Kampala, Uganda are learning God has not forgotten them. There is hope and redemption in their life stories, and God has given them a new name. International Mission Board missionary Ali White slowly began engaging the women and building trust. The women had enough interest to start a weekly Bible study. Six people came the first week. The second week, they asked a local councilman to encourage women to come. Sixty women came. Many women gave their lives to Christ that day and are still involved in the Bible study. They've chosen to get baptized and are involved in a local church in the slum. White asked Christians to pray now for the continued service of Christians in the slums of Uganda, asking God to deliver more women out of prostitution and into an eternal relationship with Him. Music duo Kenny and Claire has spent the last several years modernizing and rewriting classic hymns as a way to introduce them to the church. Yet for the married couple, their own musical journey is deeply connected to how these hymns help them through times of deep suffering. Kenny and Claire Hillard met in college at North Greenville University, where they quickly bonded over their love of music. They were soon married, but their plans came to a halt when Hilliard was diagnosed with an inoperable brain tumor on New Year's Eve 2015. A doctor was able to remove the tumor in 2016, and through the recovery process, the couple released an EP entitled Are You Weary? You can find out more about their recording and their ministry at baptistpress.com. Good News for Today is made possible through our friends at The Voice of the Martyrs, a nonprofit organization that serves persecuted Christians around the world. Founded in 1967 by Richard and Sabina Wormbrand, VOM is dedicated to inspiring believers to deepen their commitment to Christ and to fulfill His great commission, no matter the cost. Find out more and sign up for their free monthly magazine at vom.org slash goodnews. In a Bible study from Lifeway, the focus is Romans 5, 6. For while we were still helpless, at the right time, Christ died for the ungodly. In the study, the author asks how the student deals with challenges in the Christian life. The answer, the study says, is to look to Christ rather than self, not only for salvation, but for daily strength and direction as well. You can read the study in its entirety at baptistpress.com. While you're there, make sure to find other encouraging stories to help you along the way. You can find them all at baptistpress.com. Thanks for listening to Good News for Today. I'm Brandon Porter.